Hi, it's Suze. I'm back with another thrift haul. Um, I just have two quick um, store visits, visits to share with you. Um, this is from um, stores I visited in the last two weeks. Um, I The first store I went to is a store called Restore. It's located in Medford. Um, I was actually on my way to get food for lunch and was distracted by this store because they were having their vintage sale. And while I didn't find a lot of um, what I'd be hoping to find vintage, I did find a couple gems. So first off, I found this homemade um, nightgown set. I think it's homemade. There's no tags in it, but um, it looks to be made of like a possibly sheet material but it's this really cute it's got um pin tuck design on it with lace and cute little floral pattern it's maxi and then it also came with the matching um like robe or cover to go with it so that was one of my finds um I found this 1990s single stitch t-shirt, single stitch on the sleeve. Um, it is, t-shirt is brand Belton, um, but it's, it says Aida Op um, San Francisco Opera. So this is probably from a show. I think I looked it up. It's, it was from, um, I believe 81. So the shirt is as old as me, which is crazy, but, um, um, I could be wrong about that. I'll have to do a little more research just to pin down the date that this show happened there, but I thought it was really cool. And that's for resale. Um, I found this plain blue vintage cotton tee, again, single stitch, um, just for resale. I see these online. Um, they don't go for too much money, but I mean, it's a quick little flip. Um, I found this for resale. If it was my size, I'd keep it, but it's, um, by Mark, by Mark Jacobs. This was probably sold at like Dillard's or Bloomington's type stores. It's a hundred percent silk and it's a nice little striped top. I paid I think about $4 for it. I'm hoping to get about 40, 45 out of that sale. And then this is a new to me brand. It is Chalet. And I think it's a brand that produces made in the U S um, organic cotton clothes for plus size women. And I really like the shape. It's kind of got it like a captain shape. And it's really a good fall color. And so I'm going to keep that for myself. And looking at um, online what it sold for, it sold for about $120 originally. So if I decide to sell it, it would be something that I should get a good profit from. And then um, we went to White City Goodwill. And I found a couple, couple things for me, a couple things to sell. Actually, no, just one thing to sell. But I found this Free People top. Or not Free People. This is the We the Free, which is made by Free People. Just a nice little light knit um, cotton shirt. I mean, it's probably really just something I'll wear at home. I'll never wear this out in public. Um, and then I found this really cute blue and white plaid with lace and ruffles and this is by free people and I'm really cute keeping that for myself it's like a tunic shirt and then this is the one that I'll resell it's the brand the mountain and it's this funny like cat huge cat sweatshirt <laughs> So that will be for my resale shop. 
And then the last thing I have to sell is nothing I found at the thrift store. It's just another Amy Winehouse item. I am, if you're not familiar, I'm a huge mega Amy Winehouse fan. And I have a small collection of um, clothing that she wore. Um, not, well, actually, I do actually own a couple pieces that once belonged to her. Um, but I do have a collection of like, Betsy Johnson dresses and um, some Diane von Furstenberg dresses that she wore um, that they're not the exact ones that she wore but they're the exact style and brand and then this is just one of those items to add to my collection um, but it's a 1980s uh, Mickey Mouse ringer tee and she has the same had the same one um, this I'll get I'll definitely wear this and just fun to have something else in my collection um, that she once had. <laughs> I know, it's kind of crazy. Anyways, that's it. Just a quick little haul. Hope you're having a great week and I will share when I share more when I have more to share. All right. Bye.